Okay, change of plan. We're going to set trusses each and every four feet. Reason is I have this uh, nice hanger, 32 feet across. And by the way, this is the outdoor wood bar. And then you guess what? Two by four, 32 feet across. And the spacing is each and every four feet. And then the spacing of each and every uh, uh, board or lumber for supporting the uh, tin roof is each and every 16 inches, pretty much like I, I was expecting to do. Okay, I've got the two beams. We're going to pull them out of the garage and we're going to set them on the post. Well, that will be it for today. I've got the beams up. I have the back, uh, let's say, brace in. It's two thickness of a two by 10. Um, I'm going to set what we call the houses. So that's a combination of uh, two trusses together that I'm going to put up there. Tomorrow is another day. Stick around. Okay, we're the next day. We're going to set up the uh, truss on top. I've changed my mind a bit about the spacing of the trusses. 
it's going to be 38 inches in, instead of 24 and the reason is that uh, based on the hangar and most of the uh, ag building uh, they are spacing out at 48. My goal is to get an even number of uh, trusses so in the very middle of the building where it's going to be the boiler I have clear access for the chimney so I don't end up in the truss which would be sad. So we have one set of trusses set, it's uh, screwed in place in the two corners. The remaining will be, uh, let's say, free floating so I can align them with uh, uh, a string. At this point, since the boiler is going to be set in the very middle and I need uh, extra care to lift that with the excavator. It's not going to be with the forks. Uh, it's not capable of the, uh, lifting that far from that. So I'll have to rig mid boom on top of it. it. Will be funny. And to be able to sit that in place, it's going also to take uh, some precaution. I mean, uh, I'll have to put the two sets of process past their final location and then I'm going to set the border and then I'm going to push them back in place so they'll be there uh, it's going to be easier like so I think should be hopefully you see
Je vais peut-être mettre un morceau de bois, Joe. C'est à l'âme en bas. 